morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and those who are neither wherever you are in the world. I'm Ramblin' Rusty Elm, and this is Ramblin' with Rusty. Last week on Ramblin' with Rusty, we finished off our adventures in the village of Such and defeated the vampires there, in addition to collecting our last Miramur incursion event to get that achievement, before heading south to a delve along the southern edge of the map, uh, Hadron's Logging Camp, I believe it's called. And we are picking up today's episode just outside. So without further ado, let's get into it. There you are, finally. I just want to talk. <laughs> you again! Stay away from me! Help! She's going to kill me! No, wait! Oh. This is hopeless. Ugh. I'm such a screaming ninny when I panic. I suppose you saw that whole debacle? It's embarrassing enough for me to witness my own base emotions, let alone anyone else. Obviously. Though I hoped it would go better. I was experimenting with the reflective Daedric magic in this region. I always loved mirrors. During my studies, I fractured my personality, freeing my emotions to run amok. I haven't... Must I repeat myself? You saw my fear earlier. I don't miss my stupid whims, but I'm not myself without my facets. They're running wild, and now they won't return to me. Maybe... I wish I didn't need my petty emotions. They only cause trouble. I'm still linked to my facets. I sense one near a river south of Skingrad. It's probably my despair. I can be rather dramatic when I'm in a doleful mood. And the water is comforting. Okay. Well, that sounds, uh... Disturbing. So, so, so I need to go all the way over there. So uh, we do need to find these, all of these too.
wish the river would just... If only I had the energy to drown myself. I can't even do that. Despair. Sadness. Depression. What does it matter? I don't have the strength to argue with you. I hoped the river would calm me. There is one thing that might lift my spirits. Whenever I was sad as a little girl, I'd collect pretty blue flowers by the river's edge to weave into a crown. That's too kind. Really. Don't waste your time. <sighs> Why do you insist on prolonging my suffering? You could never understand the deep well of sadness that lives inside me. Spilling out in my tears. It's ineffable. An abyss so large. The flowers by the river's edge are so... You did that for me. Maybe there is still some kindness in the world. Uh, I know. I just haven't had the strength to return before now. That's true. I felt incomplete this whole time. I need her strength. There you are, darling. Let me share your burdens. Please. I don't want to be alone anymore. You won't be. Not ever again. Oh. I feel so heavy all of a sudden. Good work. That's one less facet to worry about. I feel... sad. Oh, it aches. Please, return another facet. There's one nearby. It feels boisterous. My delight, maybe. I need more than despair. It's overwhelming. Okay, so this would be in all likelihood the uh, quest that was meant to send you around all the smaller quests. You fancy a drink? Ooh, you know me. 
But I don't know you. <laughs> I'd love to share a drink and see how well you hold your ale, but I seem to have run dry. Oh, West Wheeled Wallop is the best <laughs> I knew I liked you. <laughs> you hear that, barkeep? I've got a new drinking buddy. Please, make yourself comfortable, traveler. West Wheeled Wallop, you say? That's our finest ale. Very well. One... Don't pour us around! Cheers to you, my friend! Well, ugh, that ale really packs a punch! I might take a nap for a minute. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. Don't worry, I already took her back. Can we speak, friend? <sighs> that was mortifying. I'm sorry you have to see that. I never did learn to hold my drinks. After all that, that's a fair question. I don't quite feel like myself, and that's good. But I don't think this one wants to be found. It's my fear. The same facet you saw earlier. She probably ran to the deepest place she could find to hide. I sense she's in a- Tread lightly. Southwest in the cave. Didn't you say southwest of Antis? She didn't say I'm heading east. Ah. So Oh okay, she's here. That sucks.
Not you again. You were with her. She sent you to kill me. I won't let you. Oh, really? It just fucking disappears. I really hate that ability. now. I'm part of her, aren't I? I'm her fear. That's right. And the other one, the scary Bellion, sh she's part of us too. This whole time, I, I suppose that's all right. But please, don't make me stay down here any longer. It was me. The other me. The wrong one. She was terrifying. She said I was too pretty, and she couldn't stand to look at me. I could tell she wanted to hurt me. She lunged at me, so I don't really know. I just... It's all right, darling. I'm here now. You don't have to run anymore. I was so scared. I didn't think the fear would ever end. <coughs> keeps us alive. You were doing your best. But let's work together from now on. Oh, my heart's racing. I don't like this place. Please, let's make this quick. I want to get out of here. There's only one facet left. I know which one it is now. And she... Uh, I hate admitting it's such a major part of my personality. But it's my vanity. I believe she's somewhere in Dawnwood. Which is essentially the... It's the Wood Elves, alright? Their long lives. Their ethereal beauty. I always wanted to be as beautiful as them. I'm ashamed to admit all the jealous thoughts I've had. Without luck, I should join you this time. I'll meet you in Vashabar. We have to find my vanity before she does something regrettable. I am not... not gonna do... fight my way out of here. Okay. Wood Elves, beautiful. Lady sick. I'm telling you, there's been a mistake. Give me a chance to explain. Why don't you explain how you escaped? Or what you did to my wife? 
What's going on, Alaylon? I just checked on the prisoner. She's secure. Finally, there you are. There's been a mis- This wood elf is so angry with me. I'm sure he has- This man claims I turned his wife into a pig and escaped- There's only one up. Please, let my friend speak with your prisoner. We're all eager to resolve this. Very well, but we'll accompany you. Don't try anything. I don't like this, Sir Ogwin. They might use their vile magic on us. <laughs> These wood elves think they're so perfect with their pretty little lives in their pretty little forest. None of them. Vanity! Is that all you think of me? Just shows how ignorant you are. I'm Belianne the Bewitching, sorceress extraordinaire and envy of the sisters. And if you think these binding... Jealousy, I assume. They'd hardly be the first to tie me up because of my... <laughs> More like I revealed her true form. His stupid little wife was tromping around the forest like a dumb animal. So, I decided to make her outside match what was inside. She didn't even... How dare you! You had no right! Calm yourself, Alaylon. I can't believe it. Please, this is awful. She's not just my vanity. She's my rage. I don't know. It's hard enough for me to acknowledge my vanity, let alone this rage. I understood my other facets, but this one is something I, I suppose you're right. This prisoner is my responsibility. Let me deal with her. And I'll submit myself to your judgment. Fine, but make it quick. Back off, you simpering fool. Darling, we're one in the same. I'll accept you, but you'll never hurt anyone again. You can try to stop me, but we both know I'm part of you. And I always will be. I'm so sorry for what she... Well, I did to your wife. Let me make amends. Enough of your tricks! You can fix this by returning my wife to me! Of course. Please, allow me to reverse the spell. The oh, thank Ifrae, that's over! Dearest, my love, you're back! Sir Arguin, I revoke my charges. Let the stranger leave and put this behind us. Very well. You are both free to go. Thank you. And you, friend. I won't forget all your help in this. Beauty. <laughs> Just goes to show that beauty truly is in the eye of the beholder. Okay. Now that we got that taken care of, let's head back down here. Oh wow. Okay. Let's go up here. Looks like you have your hands full there, traveler. What? <laughs> oh, cool. I adore my little menagerie, but I've always wanted to hand raise a young guzzard. Marcian still. I asked them to trap some guzzards for me. Okay. There, but I want to get this one down here. I haven't actually done it before.
Okay, let's let go that way. So I need to find a way down there. There we go. to keep an eye out for it next time though because we're out of time for today's episode ladies and gentlemen um, it's been an interesting one and tomorrow when we come back we will head into Haldane's lumber camp here and see what we can find until then I'm Ramblin' Rusty Elm have a good night and don't forget to stop and smell the roses <laughs>